This AI generates 3D high-resolution reconstructions of people from 2D images. It only needs a single image of you to generate a 3D avatar that looks just like you, even from the back. The coolest thing about this new paper is that they made a demo available on Google Collab where you can easily try it on yourself as I will show in this video. But first, let's see how they did that. This is What's AI and I share artificial intelligence news every week. If you are new to the channel and want to stay up to date, please consider subscribing to not miss any further news. Researchers at Facebook and University of Southern California recently introduced a new paper called PyFew HD, multi-level pixel-aligned implicit function for high-resolution 3D human digitization. In short, it uses a 2D image of someone to reconstruct a 3D high-resolution version of the same person. The main goal was to achieve a high-fidelity 3D reconstructions of clothed humans with detailed information such as fingers, facial features, and clothing folds as you can see in this image. Since current approaches do not use the fully high-resolution image, they downscale it due to memory requirements and lose important information to create such high-resolution details in 3D. PyFew HD achieves that by formulating the problem in two steps. First, the model is trained on the whole image at a lower resolution, downscaled, to focus on holistic reasoning. This way, it can cover a larger spatial context for the picture. Then, using this contextual information, the model estimates the detailed geometry of the person by observing the image and this first output on a higher resolution. The course level captures the global 3D structures by downsampling the image and feeding it into a PyFew model, while the high resolution details are added by using those first 3D outputs as high resolution inputs in a similar lightweight PyFew network. Because the fine level takes the features from the first level as 3D embeddings, it doesn't need to see the entire image at a higher resolution, allowing the possibility to feed this high resolution image of the person without the background. Having the information of the background in a lower resolution and the model in a higher resolution solves the computation time problem encountered with previous approaches. As you can see in this image, the multi-level PyFew is needed to obtain a high-resolution 3D model, while the single-level PyFew can create an accurate model faster if needed. This new method is extremely precise and using this two-way model makes it possible with today's memory limitations. Here are some more impressive results done using this technique. You can even try it on yourself. They made a public demo where you can simply upload your picture and see the results on Google Collab, without any GPU needed on your end. It only takes a minute or so, just try it and see by yourself if you are still skeptical. A link of this demo is in the description box below. Here's the result I got from my own pictures. It's incredible that they can achieve that without any other knowledge on me than this single two-dimensional image. Of course, this was just a simple overview of this new paper. I strongly recommend to read the paper and play with the demo and or the code which are all linked in the description for more information. Please leave a like if you went this far in the video. And since there are over 90% of you guys watching that are not subscribed yet, consider subscribing to the channel to not miss any further news clearly explained. If you want to support the channel, I now have a Patreon linked in the description where you can do that. Thank you for watching.